Hi everyone, my name is Evangeline and I'm the owner of Makeup Tips. In this video, I'm going to be doing a review and a demo on a new and very exciting product from one of my favorite brands, and that brand is Rimmel. So Rimmel have come out with the Rimmel Insta Fix and Go 2-in-1 Primer and Setting Spray. So when I first saw this, I was so excited for it because Rimmel are sort of the next brand to jump on the setting spray um, and primer spray sort of bandwagon and on a drugstore level nonetheless. So I was super excited to try this and I'm just gonna say it straight off the bat, I I love this product. I think it does exactly what it says it's going to do. So this is basically a primer and a setting spray. So you can spritz it on your skin before you apply your makeup and you can also do it after and it really just helps to increase the longevity and the wear of your makeup. Rimmel claim that this helps to keep your makeup in place for up to eight hours, which is obviously a decent claim. It's not necessarily out there. It could be done. So with some setting sprays, I find that they can leave my skin feeling quite sticky, quite tacky and sort of not very pleasant. This does not leave my skin feeling sticky or tacky and it almost feels like I've got absolutely nothing on my skin at all after I've used it. It doesn't leave my skin feeling sort of tight. I find that with a lot of setting sprays they can make my skin feel quite dehydrated and quite dry due to their large alcohol content but this one doesn't and as I said it feels like I have absolutely nothing on my skin. But just because it feels like I don't have anything on my skin doesn't mean that it doesn't actually do something. So I'm a bit of a setting spray sort of skeptic. I'm not necessarily a hardcore lover. I don't use them day in, day out, day night. Um, when I first used this, I had a really busy day. I had some meetings and I had some events. So I left at 6 a.m. in the morning and I put this on after I'd done my makeup. And before I'd done my makeup, I thought, whatever, why not give it a go? Um, 10 hours later at three o'clock in the afternoon at 2.30, three o'clock in the afternoon, this had done such an amazing job at keeping my makeup on. I was trying to figure out what it was that had actually made my makeup last that long because usually by the end of 10 hours, it starts to look a little bit, it doesn't look as good as it did when it was first applied. But this made my makeup look just as good as it did just after I'd applied it. My makeup looked really beautiful. It hadn't disintegrated. It hadn't gone cakey. It hadn't separated. Nothing like that. It did look a little bit dewy, but my foundation was already dewy anyway because I don't use powder. And it just really helped to keep that makeup on and keep my makeup looking great. So I'm definitely a big fan of this product and it's super affordable as well, which is awesome. I'll insert a little demo of me using this here. So basically to use it, what you do is I use it before my makeup. So what I do is after I have cleansed my skin and after I have moisturized my skin, I grab this setting spray, I do a quick squirt over my skin and then I use my fingers to gently press the setting spray into the skin and just make sure that it really creates a perfect base for my makeup. Now you can use this either with con in conjunction with a primer or you can use it just on top of your moisturizer. And after I have sort of spritzed my skin and it's looking great, I then go in and I apply my foundation. Um, the foundation that I use coincidentally is Rimmel. So I love the Rimmel Match Perfection Foundation and that is the foundation that I used with this setting spray. So after I've done all of my makeup then, I go in with the setting spray, I give it a quick spritz. So I go all over my face and it just locks everything into place. So after I've used it, so I do it in a T formation and then I do it in an X formation and then I just let it dry naturally. I don't go in and press it or pat it because that can sort of start to disturb the makeup underneath. But after that, it's all good. You feel like you're not wearing anything on your skin and you're like, oh, did I even put that on? But then it comes to the end of the day and you're like, wow, that really does work. I really did put it on. I'm gonna insert a bit of a picture here from when I had worn this for 10 hours. So this picture was taken after I had been wearing this foundation, this makeup, this setting spray and whatnot for 10 hours. And as you can see, it looks just as good as it did when I first applied it. So a really big thumbs up for this one. I think Romel absolutely knocked it out of the park with this launch. I'm definitely a huge fan. And if you are looking for a setting spray, I definitely recommend checking this one out. So if you did enjoy this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe and leave a comment below telling me whether you are somebody who uses a setting spray or whether you think they're a little bit of a gimmick. Also make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. And I'll also make sure to leave some links in the description box below where you can learn more about this product and where you can follow me on all my social media channels and networks.